All right, guys, welcome back. This is crazy. We're brand new here in the Moto Fast game. Um, I've been a simulator racer for so long. Grand Turismo, a set of course, uh, but I never played. Uh, I haven't played an arcade game for so long. I think the last game that I played was the last Need for Speed. Um, the one that was in Miami, Need for Speed Heat. So playing this game, yeah, it's like. It's like a better version of, you know, Forza Horizon. I mean, look at the details, you know, like the turbo spooling, shaking a little bit because the car is shaking, you know. Got the oil cooler in the front. It sounds like a rotary engine. Just like a rotary engine. And not just a regular one, we're talking about bridge ported. That is crazy, guys. This is a Mazda RX-3. One of my favorite Mazda. I got a, I own a Mazda RX-7 LC, but this is like one of my favorite ones. So let's take it out for a spin, guys. In a few and minutes, you'll enter the world of muscle cars. Beware, you may never want to leave. I just want to do a little cruise around the city. Um, to be honest, this map is pretty big. You know, I thought it was going to be like a small, uh, small map, but man, Hawaii is very big. You know, there's a lot of stuff to do. Um, again, this game is better off in a wheel. Muscle cars are more than just a 70-year-old uh, car trend. But it's an entire chunk of the American so car culture. Much better, guys. Tons of people. Very smooth. Muscle cars are the epitome um, of what a vehicle should represent. It is amazing. The, the details power, on rainy days, sunny days, and just like the right the amount of outside um, of the box thinking. Cars in the so fullest nice, might and glory. So alive. It makes the game look so different. Yo, look at that. You hear the idol of this car? Also has the inside cockpit view, which is cool. I love it. Very clean, very detailed. Man. But again, this, you'll have the best experience with you. Driving with a controller is it's not the same, um, but you know it is what it is for now. But very very fun game. Oh snap! I think I didn't make you guys. Oh yeah, we didn't. The first jump we didn't make it. The cool thing about this game, you could do a reverse, like, and you know what game did this back in the day? Um, matter of fact, let me know in the comment section, what PlayStation 3, I think it was a PlayStation 3 game, did this, where you were able to rewind your mistakes. Let me know in the comment section below. But yeah, it's an amazing car. There's other players in the game as well. These are actually live players, like people that play this game, they're here. Um, you could have a group of people playing with you in this game, which is amazing. You, know, you could do a JDM night, muscle car night, whatever cars you want to play as a group together and just enjoy the vibe. Here, here the idol. Of course, you know, 
there's a lot of missions in this game with different cars, um, different type of groups. So you will never get bored, man. You will never get bored, even though it's an arcade game, it's not a simulator, it's a simulator game. Like GT7 on Sarah Corsa. There's no standard definition of a muscle car. They are sometimes described as American made <coughs> two door sports cars with a powerful engine. You will never get but tired. That's a little reductive, don't you think? Others define them by their V8 engines and rear wheel drivetrains. The truth is, muscle cars are a philosophy. It's a creed more than anything else. So, you know, I had to stop because she was talking. I was not going to talk, talk in front of her. But yeah, guys, this is uh, an amazing game. Like I said, I love the detail. The graphics are amazing. I can't wait to see how the PlayStation 5 Pro version will look if it comes out. You know, this game is available, which I think it was, because I seen the in the PlayStation uh, Store in the catalog section when you purchase this game. Right next to the game, they have a PlayStation Pro version of Motorfest. So once I get my PlayStation Pro, which is already coming once we pre-order just imagine the details you know graphics probably gonna be crazy because now you won't have to choose either you want to have graphics or performance either you want to play at 120 frames per second or play at 60 and have better graphics now you could just play out full 4k at 120 frames per second and enjoy everything like it was supposed to mean you know man man the places you was supposed to be a 4k 120 from the beginning but it never happened either you choose performance or graphics but on the PlayStation Pro, uh, Pro that'll be all different you'll be able to play performance with graphics all together uh, that's scary want to experience it for yourself well good news we're almost there guys the way I have if you guys are wondering how can I have a clean view like this you go to the section to the setting section and just turn off all the information stuff in your HUD and you have a clean HUD like this I mean I drive it like this just to make our videos and content but when I do race I put everything back on because I want all my information so you know when I'm making content when I just want to drive with my boys and just see the, the clean screen and nothing else it just it looks amazing but yeah guys this is just a quick uh review of my take on this game this is an amazing game i was sleeping on this for so long i was so busy on grand Theft 7 and other sims i i messed up oh snap. i messed up <laughs> i messed up on not getting this game man, a whole year and look what i missed 
crazy graphics, amazing details. But the best thing is November 6th, guys. November 6th is a new update on year two of this game with a brand new island, um, which means map expansion. You know, bigger, more map, more stuff to do. So, and I hope more cars. Um, the car list is, is amazing. Uh, there's a lot of cars that are still missing. That I know they're probably gonna be here, but out of everything, I give this game a nine out of ten, man. A nine out of ten. It's, it's very good. It's very good. Um, I just, I wish I had it earlier when it came out. But you know, if you haven't got this game, get the game, enjoy the game, cause it's amazing. So this is my Mazda RX3 for now. I got a couple other cars in the garage, and we're gonna do doing reviews on that. So yeah, guys, just uh. Get the game, man. Get the game. And don't sleep on it. Because this game is crazy. Crazy, crazy. And we're going to call it. We're going to call it right here. This is a Monster RX3. Let's hear the idol one more time before we go. you hear that? Amazing, <laughs> y'all. Amazed. Oh, and um, my next purchase, of course, is going to be a Mazda RX-7 Turbo 2. It is like around 350 around there, thousand, you know, credit games, but, or game credit, but we're going to get it, and that's going to be our next review on the game. So, guys, don't sleep on this game, get the game, it's an amazing game, and I'll be seeing you on my next video, on our next content. Um, hopefully we have the RX-7 ready for the next video, and I'll see you guys in the next video then.